it's never a gamble. We're looking for a student that is the right fit for us because we want to be able to give that student what they need as well as much as we want that student to come in and be a presence here and be, you know, enmeshed in our community. So, um, I, I I know admission professionals all over the country too, at all different kinds of schools, different levels of universities and liberal arts colleges, and um, I think anybody in a, in a college admissions office would you know, not like the sound of that it's all a gamble. Um, so I think parents and students should definitely call their fears about that because there's, there is the right school for your student. I also think it's, it's important to make connections with your college admissions counselor, with admissions counselors at the colleges you're applying to, especially if you're applying to smaller schools. Um, we have the, the luxury of you know, getting to know our applicants at the stage of, you know, seeing them at your school or meeting them at a portfolio day or having them come in and sit in on a class. So it is, you know, definitely cultivate those relationships, you know, call those people, don't stalk them, but call us, let us know how interested you are. When I see a student three times at a school here on my campus at a portfolio day, I'm like, this student is really interested and I remember them. And then when we review them, I tell the faculty that, you know, this student is really into CalArts and they, they, I know they want to be here. So, yeah, there's so much in the selectivity process, but um, definitely be aware that you have, a, you have a place somewhere and that place is going to see what you have and they're going to recognize it and they're going to want to have you at their school.